What's going on you guys? Today is day two of my personal challenge towards my birthday. If you guys missed my video yesterday, I mentioned that I was gonna do a 30 day challenge where I would upload videos every single day until my birthday, which is February 25th. And today is day number two, January 26th. So day one, I uploaded a video yesterday. Today is only the second day, so I got a lot more days to go. CP3, I waited for him to jump, but he never jumped. So yes, like I'm saying, I'm going to be uploading videos daily, so please keep checking the channel, turn on the bell notifications, so you won't miss any of it. So this gameplay is a rematch against the Boston Celtics. We played them earlier in the season in Boston, and it was a pretty nice game, but this one is even better. So hopefully you guys watch it till the end, don't skip it, because I can promise you this gameplay is much better than the previous one. Chris Paul, the nice hesitation, makes DeJounte Murray jump. Gotta be shifty with Chris Paul. He goes to the reach right there, Paul George with the dunk. So this video format is about 6 to 7 minutes long, rather than 10 to 11. Mainly because the first 3 quarters, or should I say the first half, didn't have too much action, or should I say too much highlights, because it was definitely a grind. Because even though we played initially earlier in the season, he still has elite defense and you just can't score that easily so you gotta figure it out because he made some adjustments since game one that we played so I had to figure it out and Brogdon is gu gu guarding Kyle Lowry and then he ends up bumping him I really like Brogdon for his defense 6'5 point guard the length really comes in handy Paul George comes off the screen and we're down by one Kyle Lowry tries to go again on Brogdon we get the strip so Paul George goes for a three, he jumps, sidestep, re, how do you call it, relocate, and then knock down another triple. That's what Steph Curry does in real life too, pump fake, relocate, then a three. Another pump fake on Blake Griffin, but we're still down by three points. He gets in the lane, Mitchell Robinson gets the block. So if you guys notice, this game I didn't score as much as the first game because like I said, his defense is elite. And he switched, he did some, he did some um, how do you say this? He did some great, ah, I can't even talk because I just finished work, but anyways, um, he did some great defensive scheming in the first three quarters, but I think I made some adjustments in the fourth, I forgot what it was because this gameplay was um, from a few weeks ago, because right now we're in season two, but this, this is nearing the end of season one, so I don't really remember what I did exactly in the fourth, but all I can remember is the ending of the third quarter and the fourth quarter was really, really how do I say this? <laughs> really, really exciting. So now we're entering the fourth quarter. With about seven minutes to go, Paul George with the fading three. He gives us the lead right back. So Chris Paul does a pump fake on Blake Griffin. Step back, another triple. So this is back and forth. This is what I like to see. This is where the you know, champions are made, or should I say built, because you get to practice in tough situations. Because some players in these type of situations, they like to off-ball to win the game and that's not cool. But in this gameplay, there's no off-ball at all, so it's really whoever wins, wins fair and square. So we're still down by one point after that Chris Paul 3, Blake Griffin tries to drive it in the paint. Great stop by Jonathan Isaac. And we're gonna go all the way with Chris Paul, take my time, I'm trying to use the whole clock. And we get by and get the lead right back. So this fourth quarter, like I said, is back and forth. Jimmy Butler gets a spin. That should have been a charge, I think, but he gets the benefit of the doubt and gets to the free throw line. So now it's back to a tie game with a minute 45. Every possession is crucial. He ends up turning it over. So we get the ball right back. So in this fourth quarter, I'm not going to be skipping anything. I want to show it to you all so you guys get... <laughs> could see how crazy this last minute and a half was pick and roll with Chris Paul fading mid-range that's such a weird animation but anyways it went in so there's only a minute 20 left he pump fakes at the three-point line with Embiid great defense gives it back to Embiid I know he's trying to score with his star player so I'm playing great defense behind the back by John T. Murray kicks it out great rotation by our squad Man, that was beautiful rotation, Embiid back out, he takes a contested jump shot. That was a great defensive possession. Can we capitalize? 
I'm gonna take my time with the general Chris Paul. Step back, step back again, step back again. <laughs> I'm trying to create the spacing that I need to operate. So I'm taking my time, trying to see what he's doing. Nice step back. Embiid with a nice contest. I didn't expect him to jump there. So he gets the ball right back. He ends up greening a three point shot. So now we're down by one. Nice play for PG, he jumps, and I get the dunk. Man, this is crazy. 13 seconds left, DeJounte Murray on the wing. I'm gonna predict he's gonna go baseline. I move my player there, and I get the charge. Man, that was a risky play, because if he didn't go baseline, he would have had a wide open lane for a dunk. So he ends up following me, Paul George to the line. I make the first. Can I make the second one to make it a three-point basketball game? I miss! He decides not to call a timeout, lobs it out full court. JJ Redick, open three, I jumped. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow, we dodged a bullet right there. I didn't expect him to throw it full court like that. And I plus, I jumped way too early. And he had open three with no contest. So we really dodged a bullet there. Great game. Overall, man, this was... <laughs> This was definitely a thriller. This is crazy. I'll see you guys for tomorrow for another video. So this is really awesome. So please drop a like and a comment. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get flashed, please be sure to share and like this video. To stay updated, click subscribe and also follow G Flash on Twitter.